Hi, I'm Lisa Nelson, celebrity makeup artist, and today I'm talking about how to do navy blue makeup. So blues can be a little bit intimidating, and I can understand why. We take a great deal of time to try to conceal and cover underneath our eyes to avoid dark circles, right? So why would we want to wear any color that might, we might take the risk of enhancing that? So what I want to teach you today is something that you could integrate into your makeup wardrobe, if you will, and feel totally confident wearing navy. When we're talking about blue eyeshadow, it's not our mother's blue eyeshadow. The pigments are really rich and they're more of a satin finish. I would advise experimenting with blue and just have fun with it. Makeup is not surgery, guys. You can have a great time with it and you can always wipe it off. If you don't like it, you can always change it. So as you can see on our beautiful model, we have actually done one of her eyes already. And you'll notice that this is very approachable. It's a little more high fashion, maybe a little more edgy, so you could save this for a nighttime look. But I think that it's really appropriate. Even you could wear this to the office if you wanted to. And the key here is to wear to choose shades that are not too frosty or too high shine. So what we've done with this is we've done a pigment all over the eye, and I'm actually going to walk you through the steps on the other side. You'll notice also that we partnered it with some browns and some more neutral earth tones, so you could integrate these blues with the colors that you already wear on a daily basis. So I have a little two-sided brush. I'm going to start out with a nice navy color. And just for safety, we're going to take a little sponge and put it underneath. Now you could use um, some tissue or something like that. Go ahead and close for me. What we're doing by placing that underneath is to catch any extra shadow. Whenever you're working with colors that are highly pigmented or blues or maybe you're doing a smoky eye, you want to make sure that you put something underneath just to catch any fallout that might occur. So what we're doing is just laying down this original color. This is a nice pretty satin finished navy. Starting at the lash line, kind of building the color out into the sort of winged effect on the outside of the eye. And build that right across. When you work with a color like a blue, you want to start out minimal. Don't put too much product on your brush. You can always go back and add more. Start out too much and it's going to create sort of a splotchy, darkened effect and it's going to grab you want to build this in layers. So we're just going back in and enunciating that outer corner. We use two shades for this. Now that we've built the general color, the general shape of the eye, we can go back in and cover it with a slightly darker shade of navy. Starting at the lash line again, and you're sort of outlining now the blue that you've already laid down. I come back in towards the inner corner of the eye. What I would not advise doing, and it's your, to your discretion, but this again is my style on a navy blue eye, I would not go underneath with this. The reason being, again, is that we don't want to enunciate any dark circles there. So let's just keep the blue color on top. And then what I really want to show you is how you could do something with a brown shade. So this is sort of a medium brown. And we're just going to lay that down to sort of blend out that hard blue line. We're going to go right above, starting on the inside corner and working it out. And in this way, you're bringing some earth tones into this so that even though it is more dramatic, it's more approachable this way. Another thing you can do is take like a chocolate brown, a darker. You notice that we didn't do a blue liner with this. We're integrating some browns in with the blue. You can absolutely do that. Little angled brush here. We're just working in the corner. Out towards the wing here. And one more time, we're gonna go back in. Go ahead and look up for me. We're gonna work in the outer corner, coming in about halfway to where the iris begins, where the iris is sort of lined up. when looking straight forward. In this way, you keep the lines more neutral, or tones, go ahead and close your eye one second. 
but you pop that color in there and it looks great. So this is kind of my spin on the navy blue eye. And we've done just a neutral lip, neutral cheek. You want to keep the lips more natural, um, not as colorful, as long as there's harmony here and here. You can let the eyes really show. Frame the eye with a nice eyebrow. So I'm Lisa Nilsson, and that's how I would do a navy blue eye.